Hello again, I'm Rodney Reynolds and welcome to another video review. Today I'm looking at the Patriot Torx 128GB solid state drive. What's included with the solid state drive is a user's manual, a 2.5 inch to 3.5 inch drive bay adapter. They also include 8 screws, 4 are used for mounting the drive into this adapter and then 4 more for mounting the adapter to the case. They also include a jumper for updating the drive's firmware. The Patriot Torx line of Serial ATA2 solid state drives are currently available in three capacities 64GB, 128GB, and 256GB. Solid state drives have been around since 1978, developed by a company called Storage Tech. Solid state drives are very similar to USB drives or any type of flash or compact memory, like for example the memory that goes into your camera. Solid state drives have several advantages over standard hard drives because they have faster access times, lower temperature, are much more reliable because they have no moving parts, are tougher and silent. They are also lightweight, have a much smaller footprint and consume less power than standard hard drives. Solid state drives have their disadvantages though. They are still very expensive. Capacities are low, currently between 16 gigabytes and 256 gigabytes on the consumer end but higher capacity solid state drives are on the way. Also some older solid state drives can have slower write times and more CPU usage than standard hard drives. As you can see this 2.5 inch Serial ATA solid state drive is much smaller than a standard Serial ATA 3.5 inch hard drive. Note that this piece of white paper does not come stuck on the drive. I'm just using it to cover up the serial number. Here's the Serial ATA power connection as well as the Serial ATA data connection. There are eight screw holes on this drive for mounting it, two on each side, and four more on the bottom. This solid state drive has a brushed aluminum look on the front and the back. At the top of this drive you'll find the capacity as well as some more information the model line and on the back is the serial number as well as the complete model number. The performance on this drive is fantastic, but that's to be expected from a brand new solid state drive. If you want the fastest single drive on the market today, you'd go with a solid state drive, but they are still very expensive and capacities are low. This one is mid-range. It's 128 gigabytes, which is not a lot, but it should be okay for your primary boot drive. Overall though, this is a kick-ass product. Until next time, take care.